She was married to Henry VIII and Queen of England from 1533 until 1536, until she was beheaded following accusations of adultery and incest. Many original portraits of Anne Boleyn were destroyed after her execution in fear for upsetting the king. This is one of the few thought to be in existence. But now it seems Henry VIII's attempt to erase his second wife from history after chopping off her head may have been thwarted after more than 470 years. Scientists from the University of California at Riverside have used an old portrait and facial recognition software to identify her face. The software is developed from systems used to identify people in CCTV. It works by comparing a range of physical proportions, such as the width of the mouth and distance between the eyes, to assess the extent of a match between two portraits. A study has matched the portrait with the only known contemporary image of Anne on the Moost Happy Medal, which was stamped in 1534 to commemorate the expected birth of her son. Anne lost the baby seven to eight months into pregnancy, explaining why multiple copies of the medal were not commissioned. The prototype survived and is today housed in the British Museum. Scientists say that a comparison of the faces in a range of portraits thought to represent Anne has identified only one, the Nid Hall portrait, as being the same as the face printed on the Moost Happy Medal. It was previously thought by some to depict another of Henry's wives, Jane Seymour. The facial recognition software indicated that other portraits of the beheaded queen, including one hanging at the National Portrait Gallery, are actually nothing of the sort.